Hello friends, Tell here. We're going to be taking another look at uh, Heroes of the Storm in my new series, To the Nexus. Today I'm going to be playing Uther. Um, I love Uther in this game, personally. I'm not a big fan of supporting, but Uther is one of my favorites. A friendly team is going to be Sergeant Hammer, Li Ming, Chen, Asmodin versus Lunara, Tyrael, Raynor, Nova, and Lili. So, pretty balanced team, actually. Um, Chen isn't the best tank, but he keeps himself alive really well. Having a couple of nice stuns on Uther, so getting Lunara, Nova, or Lili are definitely going to be a priority, especially interrupting her Thousand Brew thingamabob that heals everyone. Uh, so, fortunately, uh, I just got a new job, which is why I've kind of not put a video up for like two or three days. Um... Which, I mean, unfortunately, that's going to be a cause that I was kind of waiting to get a good schedule done so I can kind of put a little bit of order in my chaotic life. Um, th but to end on a good note, I mean, no one watches my videos anyway, so what does it matter? No one's missing them. So it's all good. Um, yeah, anyways, I mean, I've lost two out of two games so far. I'm absolutely sure that that is not a trend that's going to continue and everything will be fine. I'll be amazing this game. We're going to win this game. And I won't just stumble backwards into mediocrity it'll be fine it'll be fine no worries no worries whatsoever definitely positive about this and this load screen is taking forever so that's good too anyways um yeah i mean ideally i want to be releasing one of these videos a day uh right around 5 p.m or so um especially as i take a little bit of a longer look at the legion information uh, i can't just make a video on legion every single day as much as i would like to but uh, it's definitely something that I kind of feel I, I want to be more than just World of Warcraft, even though World of Warcraft will always be my one true love. Um, so I definitely want to make sure that I'm doing something more than just WoW, especially in the downtime when there's not much to talk about besides the alpha. Uh, hopefully, I get into the Overwatch beta when it comes back up. I only was in a, a testing weekend, um, and that was unfortunate. Because I love, the fir I love the game. I absolutely adore the game. And I really want to be able to play it and make videos on it. So hopefully I'll get into it. Uh, but anyways, let's focus on this now. So as Uther, first thing I want to take, I just want to heal everybody. That's I need to make sure people stay alive. They have Lunara. Uh, do they have a Leeming? They don't have a Leeming, but they do have a Lunara and a Nova and a Rainer. And they do a lot of damage. So first thing I'm going to go ahead and do is just to go healer, Conjure's Pursuit. I just want mana. I want to be able to heal people when I want to heal them and not have to worry about mana. Sergeant Hammer's dead within 3 seconds. 25 seconds. So this will be this will be fine. I'm not worried whatsoever about how terrible every single one of these games has been. It's fine. It's no worries. We will be fine. Probably. Just going to smack this a couple times. Oh. I do love that Nova skin. Too bad that they um, did some pretty extensive changes on her. Honestly, I haven't played Nova since the changes. I'm not sure how she plays. I'm not sure if it's good. I'm not sure if she's still strong. I had a game before um, with Nova who seemed to be doing okay. But you could obviously tell that it's not to the level that she used to be. So, who knows. But anyways, me and Shin are going to be up here in the top lane, facing off against potentially a Nova. I'm not entirely sure if she's stuck around. Chen needs to watch out, though, because I do not have... There we go. Think about Uther. He has very powerful heals, but they are on cooldown sometimes. Like, there's a thing called the cooldown that his abilities have. Sometimes people aren't entirely aware that they exist. And that never makes it fun for... You know, to be that healer who's just like, please, please come back, please come back, and, you know, you're just, they're just dying. Looks like we are able to push them out. I'm just going to go ahead and make sure I zone them a little bit more. Uther is a surprisingly tanky support, which is, is nice. You don't have to feel as bad. Now, the thing about Conjurer's Pursuit is I do not think that I am the best person at maintaining any of these types of uh, orb, orb uh, talents. Because, to be honest, I slack on it from time to time. I really do. And I'm hoping that... I mean, I, I'm aware that I'm not the best person at keeping it up. It's just That's just the truth. Zing, by the way. Um, but it helps. It's still a good talent. Sometimes I take the one that lets me do my stun more often for basic attacks, but in this situation I really just want to go ahead and have some extra mana. No one is soaking bottom, that's a problem. But our team is fighting in here, so let me go to them. 
I do love taking basic attacks restore mana. Uh, as Uther, I do play him very much as a character who's just in there melee attacking and doing doing work, basically. I like maintaining that on my Uther. In fact, in teams where I have multiple healers, I even like to do things such as more melee build, where I'm very specifically going to be healing people on the basic attacks. But I know that's not the best talent, and I'm actually really trying to win this time, so full on support this time. Because, please... If I don't have a win, how will any one of my many viewers enjoy my videos, right? Right? Yeah. You guys exist. You just don't know it yet. You exist, just in the future. And in the future, you're gonna watch these videos and think, that's silly tell. We love his videos. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Jesus. So yeah, Li Ming does a metric shit ton of damage. That is uh, something to be said, for sure. And I'm actually going to be getting her soon and making a pretty good video on her, hopefully. Hopefully I'm not terrible. I'm very aware of how powerful she is. She's very squishy, so it's not like she's overpowered. But she's definitely a character that you want to be safe on, poke at, and then blow them the fuck up. Just blow them absolutely to sky high. So, still playing here. It doesn't really look like any team is has the advantage. It looks like we have a little bit of an XP lead, but it does look like they have all the kills so far. So... I'm not a particular type of person that likes looking at the stat screen too often. I'll look at it sometimes maybe to see a problem person, someone who's dying just all the damn time that I maybe have to watch out for, especially with um, the talent that I'm going to be taking in this uh, this fight today, which is going to be Divine Shield. Yeah, that's the name. So maybe I'll do that just to keep an eye on people, make sure that key people are being kept up. Uh, they're fighting without me right now, which is kind of dangerous, but I need to clear this wave. We need to keep soaking. We need to keep this XP lead that we have, because if we get 10s before them, it will definitely help us out in the next seed phase. So as I'm saying that, I'm going to go ahead and, let's see, they have Lunara, Tyrio, Raynor, Nova. Nothing that will really CC anyone for too long, so I'm not going to take Cleanse. I'm just going to go ahead and take uh, Wave of Light. I want to be healing people all the time. I want to be using Wave of Light more often, and I want to be able to get some mana when I use it. Specifically when it heals a hero, a friendly hero, of course. I'm going to get some mana back for it. I'm just going to get that real quick. And put a little more pressure on Jimmy. Definitely wants to hit me. Just barely out of range. Can't hit me, Jimmy boy. Oh, he's, oh he almost got me. Okay. Okay. We're fine. We're fine. Now the problem with going up against a rage character like this is he can just poke me and do a lot of damage to me, push me out, force me to back off. It's kind of annoying, but I need to make sure I pick up this orb. Which I will do there. And done. Move back a little bit, let me heal myself up. Doesn't use too much mana, can heal some of it back up. My basic attacks. Just kind of keeping him at bay. I don't want him to get too many shots off on our towers. I don't want to give him that advantage. A little too much here. This might be a bad idea, but nope, we're going to get out of that. And now we have our 10s, which is going to be fine. Divine Shield. Make sure I avoid taking extra damage from him. Hit him with that. Li Ming is coming up. Let me try to get the stun on him. Can we get him? Yes! Beautiful, beautiful assist. Fire Li Ming. Thank you so much. If I was Malfurion, I'd give you some mana so you can continue to wreak havoc. But I'm not, so I'll just heal myself instead. It's fine. Try to tank some of this for our wizard friend. And our entire team is just dying. Feels like, at least. Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. It looks like only one person died. I'm sorry, I'm a little bit in super try-hard mode. I really want to win. Promise. <laughs> I don't want this series to just be me with my endless optimism, but never winning. That would just be sad. I'd, I'd get sad. I'd probably just stop making them. Or, conversely, if I just had a bunch of people tuning in constantly to watch me lose, I mean, I'm okay with that, right? I have like one, I think I have one subscriber. I'm okay. I'm okay with just making terrible, terrible videos. That was always the plan. But anyways, 
Jimmy's coming over here. Looks like we might be able to give him another stun and get another kill on him. Yeah, he's dead. He's not going anywhere. Just heal up our hammer. Chen has that shield, so he can kind of keep himself okay. Let's beat on this sea giant. Let's back up a little bit, make sure Chen's taking the hits. Oh, he's going to be rooted, which is not good. Throw him another heal. Get out of the way of this giant. Heal out Li Ming there. Uh, she has a very low health pull, so my heal is going to do a lot more for her. Get a stun there, try to kill. Come on, can we get her? Can we get her? Yes! The flying kick will seal that kill in. I think we got Tyrael as well. Just get away from his explosion. Brilliant. That was a very good fight. We didn't lose anybody. We got two kills. It's good, good work. Good work indeed. Oh, I didn't get credit for that. That's annoying. Let's see. So what are we going to be taking on this tier? Um, very partial shrink ray. I really like controlling the enemies. Uh, spell shields, fine, but... Yeah, I'm gonna take Shrink Ray. I need, I'm trying to be as supportive as humanly possible, as utherly possible, <laughs> and I really just want to make sure that I'm able to keep our friend, my friends, out of danger. Let's not tank this. Okay, he just hates me, I guess. So fine, fuck you too. Catch up to Lee here. Nope, I'm not gonna get him. Let's make sure everyone else is fine. Heal ourselves. Did he get the most of those seeds? I think he might have picked up those seeds. Let's go make sure our wizard doesn't die. Oh, didn't heal her like I was trying to. There we go. Chen just move in, get that kill. Oh, got her just barely. Just in time to save her. Probably want to move out of this. Shit is just going ham. Oh, no, we're going to get a kill on. Yeah, we got a kill on Jimmy. Let's see if I can stun her. Yep, no, she's down. Let's make sure this thing dies. I don't want it to get some ammo and make it more difficult for us later on. Uh, I guess I just have to keep healing Uther. Uh, sorry, I'm Uther. Keep healing Chen. Get that up. Yeah, bring his health right back up. Uh, I'm trying to think. Okay, imposing presence. If someone basic attacks me, I want to make sure that I'm. Oh, got a healer! Got a healer! Oh, just run, just run. Just get some kills, it's fine. I'll heal you back up, it'll be fine. And I'm dead. But that's fine. It's fine. We have a four level lead on our enemies. Um, I feel like we stayed in that fight a little too long, but we were trying to support the Sea Giant. They have completely ignored him for the most part. Um, he still has a little bit under half health. We were able to direct them away, get a kill on Lunara, I was able to save our wizard friend, which is my entire focus in this game. I want her to be alive. If she gets kills, if she stays in the game longer, she will become more and more deadly and just obliterate the enemy team. I've seen it happen. A Li Ming that's able to get kill it doesn't have to be... She doesn't have to one-shot everybody. She just needs to stay in the fight long enough for someone to die and everyone else to be at about a half health, and she'll just start dropping the entire enemy team like flies. It's brilliant. So that's my entire goal as Uther. I want to keep her up so that she can keep melting people's faces. And I think we're actually, yeah, we're, no, we're being pushed back right now. I'm on my way right now. I'm going to let them know that I'm going to go help them. Um, but, I mean, that's that's honestly the power. And that's why, that's one of the reasons I love Uther. A lot of the other healers have, like, one or two heals. And it's kind of always been a very frustrating thing for me when I'm playing. When it's on cooldown and just I have no more options left. I hate that feeling. But on Uther... I feel like there's always an option. There's always something I can do. I have two heals. I have 
a way to slow down and reduce a person's health, uh, uh, speed I should say, and uh, their attack damage. I have options available to me so that I'm able to help my teammates. You can even take holy fire and do damage around you, which is awesome. Um, I'm particularly just wanting to slow some auto attacks because obviously I'm staying in the fray, I'm going to be in the people's faces, I'm trying to help my team, I want to make sure I'm keeping them up. So when I'm getting hit, I want to make sure that I'm, you know, stopping. Or I may, if I'm soaking some of the hits, I'm slowing down their attack speed. They make the mistake, the accidental mistake of hitting me, and they're screwed. You go and make sure Asmodin stays alive. I don't think I can do much for you, Asmodin. I'm sorry. Maybe that was enough to keep him alive. Was it? Was it? Was it? It was. Yep, oh, no, I'm gonna die for my foolishness. It's fine. It's fine. That was my fault. It's my foolishness for going to in. Try to keep up Asmodin. Did my best. He needs to, to stay alive. Oh, I don't know. No, he's not gonna make it. We gotta put Oh my god, that was that was beautiful. Good job. Asmo did a great job staying alive, doing damage. I did what I could. I probably am the reason he died. Um, I just didn't stay safe. That was just the honest truth. I want to get an extra hit with Holy Radiance, so that was my fault. But at least we were able to turn around, get a lot of kills on them, make sure we got some more seeds. I'm thankful that I didn't cause us to lose him, myself, and that fort. But it was definitely a misplay on my part. That can't be argued. A wizard has low mana, which is never a safe way for her to be. So I'm going to go on I'm gonna head up there. Actually, no, we're just going to win the game. Okay, so, yeah, we're going to win the game. So, for love of God, I actually won a game. Holy crap. Maybe I'll get view. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I feel like that game was very well played. Everyone on our team knew their role, did what they were supposed to do. Asmund made sure the lanes were pushed. He made sure he was in that uh, the sea giant. Our Leeming did great damage. I, if I am allowed to toot my own horn for a second, I was able to keep our team up. I didn't do more healing with Lily. She has her bruise and everything. But I was able to keep people alive when I needed to keep them alive. And I was able to Divine Shield them at very key moments. So, all in all, a pretty good game. Uh, so, yeah. This has been Tao. This has been my third episode of To The Nexus. Um, the first one I win. Thank Christ. Um, but, yeah. If you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe all that jazz um, I like making videos I want to make more videos I want this to be something that I'm doing constantly whether I find success and fortune that's to be decided but at the end of the day I just enjoy doing this and if you enjoy my content if you like what you see it would I would appreciate just at the very least a like just let me know if there's something I should change let me know if you like the format um, and I hope that you personally have a wonderful day thank you very much